called Master of Spinjits, the Golden Weapons. Da -da -da -da. Golden Weapon. Hmm. Yeah! Hooray, we kicked their bony backsides, Jay said. Jay, Cole, Kai, and they were celebrating. They had defeated the skeleton warriors three times. Now they had three of the golden weapons as Spinjitu. We just need one more. Even Sensei Wu was in the good mood. He got up and danced. Later, while everyone slept at Wishful Kai, it was his sister Nia, but how? Samika had captured her and taken her to Garmin and into Underworld. I have to go, said Nia said. She ran off. She, Akai raced after her. She followed her to a red temple. Inside the temple, Kai saw the fourth weapon of Spinjitu, the Sword of Fire. Nia appeared in front of it. Nia cried. Kai cried. She ran. He ran towards her. Don't worry, I'm right here, Nia said. But as she spoke, she transformed into a dark shadow of Garmadon. Garmadon moved aside, and Kai saw her re his real sister hanging by the pit of the lava. In your world, I can't take the sword of fire, Garmadon said, but you can take it from me. For me. Nia started to slide down toward the lava. Kai knew there was only one way to save her. She had to take the sword and cut chains. Kai grabbed the sword. Ninja! Go! He cried. He swirled and whirled, turning into a glowing red tornado. Then he flew over the lava. He cut the chains and grabbed Nia, then landed land safely on the rock. Garmin and Shadow rode in front of Kai. He swung the sword, but it went right through the shadow. Then Garmin and kicked Kai, and Kai fell down. That's not fair, cried Nia. Garmin and Shadow made copies of himself. All the shadows attacked Kai. The sword fell off his hands. Garmin had picked up the sword. Then there was a new shadow jump behind him. It was Sensei Wu. The Sensei used his own shadow to fight Garmin on shadow. He got the sword back. But what? Of the other two weapons, Lord Garmadon asked, they are safe. Are you sure? asked Garmadon. After our camp, a noise woke Carl. He gasped. Skeleton warriors Nuncle and Cruncha had captured Jay and Z. Their king Samakai held the three weapons of Spinjitzo in his bony hands. Ah! I believe these belong to Lord Garmadon. Now, he said, grinning. Back at the temple, Sensei Wu turned to Kai and Nia. My brother must not unit the four weapons. He warned, awaken gar garden of the sword, Garmadon yelled. Do not let them escape. A huge red dragon. When rolled up from the bubbling lava, it spread its rings and roared. There was only one, one, one escape. Down into the underworld, Sensei Wu used the sword to cut the rocks beneath his feet. As the rock floated on the lava, carrying him away. Sensei, no! Kai cried. I must take the Sword of Fire to the underworld, Sensei said friendly. Mm. <laughs> I don't see 
see you there, brother, Grandma Dawn said as he shouted disappeared. It's all my fault, Kai wailed. Tensei won't be able to hold out for long. Then forget Sensei, said Mia, looking up at the angry dragon. What about us? Back to camp, Samakai jumped into his soul culture. To the underworld, he cried. The skeletons were sped away, leaving Cole and Jay behind. But now what? Cole said, now get out of here. <coughs> he drew a sword and taken from the uncle that he got the rope and they all hit to the ground. The ninja raced after Samurai. They, they jumped onto the skull shark, smacked, pow! Cool went after Knuckle and Cruncher. Dre ran up a hand and whack! Cole accidentally hit him in the throat. The skull shark reared up on the back wheels. Jay, Cole, and Zane tumbled off. The the truck vanished into the underworld. Jay, Cole, and Zane ran to the temple, Red Temple. I sense that the weapons are in the underworld, Zane said. We are too late. Then he heard Kai's voice. We may not be able to cross over the underworld, he said, but a dragon can. The temple door is open. The ninja gasped when he saw Kai and Nia, Nia riding the fire dragon. Um, temple, fire temple, um, yeah, um, dragon Dragons belong to both worlds, so they can travel between them. Nia yeah, explained. Kosha. No way he was terrified of dragons. Kai jumped down and patted the dragon's head. Once he realized we were trying to protect the sword of fire, he became quite a softy. He needed to good goodbye to his brother. Soon the ninja was flying across the each each one riding an elemental dragon. Easy, easy, crowed the nervously as the earth dragon soared across the sky. This is awesome! Cried, seeing Cray back from the back of the ice dragon. <sighs> the dragon flew to the a long dark tunnel that led them to the underworld. They saw Garmadon's black plant palace in the distance. Skeleton warriors guarded the entrance and say is inside near. Yeah. Zane said, and they expecting, they're expecting us to, to get to the underworld. The four ninjas swung from the black rocks that hung up down from the underworld. Dre grabbed into a log and skinny rock. He looked up and saw that it was the leg of a giant spider. Black, black, black. Holy, I don't know, black. That's a nickel. But his throat still hurt. His friends didn't understand him. The eyes and then he finally looked up and saw the spiders. Ah! They screamed. They let go and the warriors have surrounded them. Then spiders dropped down. Uh oh, cried Sky cried. A battle between brothers. Inside the palace, um, Sensei heard a voice behind him. Brother, Garmadon said. Since it would turn to spun around, he drew the sword of fight. Brother, he said. Since the sword, Garmadon yelled. The skeleton warriors jumped and fell out from the shadow. Then they would use spinches. A golden tornado swirled, knocking down the squirrel skeleton one by one. Oof, 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 oof. You'll have to take it from me, since he was told his brother, Samakai appeared. My pleasure, he growled, waving the other three weapons 
was twenty two, he let out the roll and charged at Sensei. The old man somersault right over Samuka, but the skeleton blocked it with the side of quakes. Outside, the ninja needed a plan. Jay knew what to do. Rock, limp, yaw, he cried. You need a vacation? Kind asked, frustrated. Jay yelled as loud as he could. Tornado of creation! Tokazio. Let's do this, said Cool. Earth! Fire! Young Kai. Ice! cried Jay. Lightning! Shouted Jay. Ninja! Not all four ninja. The ninja tornadoes burned brightly. Oh, no, she done. They and then they joined together. One lucky, one giant swirling tornado whipped every warrior, spider, and object in his butt. Now they were all transformed into a giant ferris wheel made out of bones. The skeleton warrior trapped inside. Come on, there's no time to waste. You got tornado of creation, old Duncan, tornado old man to death. Um, bones that kept blowing away and then um, um, the bones of the original ferris wheel the man to the second a jail fairy. We had to just buy um, to our skeletons early, we had a trapping daily. The four ninja hurried into the palace, then they saw Sensei Wu battling Samika. Samakai fought hard, but it was one like a weapon against three. Samakai used the shurikens of ice to free the sword. Then he used the side of course to shake the ground. Finally, he heard the nunchuck of lightning at Sensei, shocking him. The sword fell out of his head. Bring me the four weapons, Grummer then demanded. Samaka picked up the sword. No, you will obey me now, he told Garmida. The weapons began to shake and glow. Garmida and Leo laughed. No one can handle all that power at once, Sensei said. Hmm? Your serious teacher. What's happening to me, Samika wailed. You have fallen into my master plan. Garmina replied, not even I can handle the power of all four weapons. But now that they have combined, it will create a vortex through to space and time. I can finally escape the underworld. Boom! Samika vanished into the a storm of white light. A glowing blue tunnel appeared. Garmida went towards it. Soon I will be strong enough to hold the far one end, he boasted. Then I will make the world in my image. The vortex disappeared, and so did Garmida. He is gone, since he said, but he will return. Kai picked up the sword of fire. Jay picked up the nunchucks. Cole grabbed the side and Zanger the shurikens. Then we'll be ready for him, Kai vowed. Mm -hmm.